and hello and welcome to Zen Plays Games Badly. Uh, this stream, as you uh, all know, is my attempt at showing off me badly playing games. So hopefully, uh, for the... Hello. And welcome to Zen Plays Games. For those of you joining us, uh, this is uh, me attempting to play Titanfall 2. Uh, now, if you can remember uh, the uh, last stream that we did of this, then you're doing better than me. I've been playing GTA for you. Uh, in the meantime, if you don't know, uh, I don't know what happened to those streams, you can find those streams uh, online at bit uh, bit.ly forward slash Zen Plays Games. That's my uh, YouTube channel where I've also got some of the stuff that I also stream from the PS4. Uh, mixtures of uh, No Man's Sky, GTA, a bit of Titanfall, that kind of thing. Now we have had some uh, unhelpful uh, things from Mixer. So we don't have as many streams from the Xbox as we would like. It seems that the streams are for some reason dropping sound. So hopefully... We've done a quick test. This seems to be working. So we'll be with you, hopefully, for the rest of the stream. Down. Right. Now, I have absolutely no idea uh, what we were doing. Um, we were conceivably fighting some big bad, and we are likely to have gained some weaponry. Uh, so this is the view from inside our Titan, our big stompy, stompy Titan. Now all we need to do is to work out where it is that we're meant to be going. And we can we can get on with it. Let's see if we can fit in here. Go up the ladder. Pilot, recommend you disembark. Yes, thank you. We can't go and talk to these guys unless we are not in the Dude, for those of you that haven't seen him, there he is, in all his glory. Transmission sequence is working. Power at 25% and climbing. 60% good, almost 80%. Oh, there we go, we are actually transmitting this time. Hopefully we can save all these people. Oh, there we go. Commander Briggs, this is BT seven two seven four. That's BT. That's, that one's BT. Report intel to the fleet attached to the SRS. So we're going to be sending our intel out. Good to hear you guys are still down there. We are indeed still we're down here. Thank you. Now. And that was it. Apparently, where we stopped playing was just before the end of the mission. Data recorder says your original pilot was KIA. Correct. Captain Ty Lastimosa was killed in action. I am now linked to an acting pilot, Rifleman Jack Cooper. Wait a minute. Lastimosa linked you to a rifleman? Yes. He had no other options. Understood. We'll get you transferred to a fully qualified pilot. Objection. Cooper is my pilot. Our combat effectiveness rating now exceeds 90%. Request permission to retain this link. Wow. The robot wants to keep me. You're lucky our backs are up against the wall, BT. Permission granted. Oh, isn't she being High nice. praise coming from a machine, Cooper. Thanks to I your scan data, don't talk to BT like he's a machine. Signature to an IMC base right here on Typhon. We don't have much time. Let's go. Ah, we get to keep the ship, and we are off. Somewhere to go and upset the IMC. So there is a plot to this. Um, basically, things with Titans and things uh, against the Titans. Some long-winded plot that I was presumably meant to be paying attention to. But it really honestly hasn't stayed. I think that probably says more about the plot than it does about me. Uh, but... What I'm kind of enjoying is it is basically a standard platform shoot 'em up. Oh, cutscene. 
cutscenes, I'm going to guess that was some sort of repair robot. Uh huh. Your mission is to capture the Ark before it can leave the airbase. Marauder Corps, weapons hot. Stand by for Titanfall. Oh, here we go. Actual Titanfall, what the game is named after. So we are Titans, and this is us falling. Uh, well, I mean, I suppose the, uh, the point is in the name of the game, really. Get to cover, pilot. We're taking down that wall. We're going to take down this wall. Right, so we to take out the Well, that didn't last long, did it? That didn't last long at all. So it turns out those cannons are quite strong. And me attempting to take them out on my own is, hasn't really gone my way. Right, take two. Uh, so we can. We've got this energy shield. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Um, so we kind of grab the weaponry and bring it back to them. Uh, but again, already our core is, is dropping um, something on it. Let's see if we can get out of it. Well, that seems to have worked quite well. Oh, there's one. Oh, that's not a tower, that's a titan. Now, these guys are good, but I suppose they are they, they must be good. I've been playing the game for a bit now, so... Do these kind of little scenes of big machines, uh, kind of, uh, shooting other little machines, are kind of the, the point of the game, but it's not actually where the, uh, where the hard part of the game so far has been. Um, being able to kind of throw weaponry back at them um, means that they, by and large we tend to can blow them up. Oh, so we'll, uh, we'll just uh, walk around the other side then. They're flying, flying that one. Uh, but uh, uh, because of the, the amount of damage that these things can it doesn't actually seem to do make much of a difference. Uh, where you where you actually go and how much Oops, don't shoot your own. Oh, wasn't quick enough there. Keep moving. Keep moving. Okay. Um, oh, there we are. So there's some healing just behind here. That, that is in fact a bad sign. First core online. That means we can do some a nifty amount of extra damage to this thing. Uh, though unfortunately, how? Um, there we go. Oh, blue on blue. Right, okay. Let's stop doing that, shall we? <laughs> no, yeah, don't attack the people that are on your side. That's uh, not a good idea. There go, bit of healing. Now, this guy is not on our side, so that's a good thing. Nope. And these are one way shields that you can fire through. There go. Let's just boom. So if you saw that, the shield that we kind of popped up there, uh, we can send um, their weapons back to them with Ah, there we go. We are not a very well uh, kind of uh, vehicle. I'm just going to run away until we can pull up there. That green thing over there, that's healing. If you have a look at the bar at the top. Um, I don't want to get into the fight with you just yet, yeah. Uh, it, will sh it will show you how much health we've got, which is not a lot. So we were going to need to doing a absolute lot of damage. So uh oh. Here we go. That was so close. So, so very close. I like this stuff. And. Oh, uh, behind us. There we go. So we're now in a much better shape than we were. 
That one's still not on our side. Let me make sure that that. Okay. Now these do have different weapon loadouts. Uh, but this seems to be the one that I am most affected with. It is the uh, uh, first one that you get to pick up. Um, uh, but it, it, despite that, I still find the uh, the shield that allows you to send things back to be one of the most effective weapons that I find in the game. I suppose for some of them, being able to do a large amount of damage, I did have a bit of fun with the shotgun, uh, but I wasn't as effective as I would have liked to. Um, shotgun is one of those weapons where you kind of need is, is time. Uh, you don't really get time to practice uh, in this kind of game. It is uh, bullet hell, basically. And the more bullets you can fall into your opponent, uh, the, uh, at the greater pace, the better. We've got the burst core ready, so we could. We're going to save it. That is a nifty little. Uh, so this one appears to be um, quite a big, uh, quite a big one. We're just going to step out of that for a minute, I think. Go. Right. Go. And wait, because this other one is definitely helpful. We don't want to spend our time shooting it. There we go. That's that one dealt with. Now we need to keep moving. Watch Ah, now we're against humans. This is basically just going to be a large amount of. Um, uh, the buttons. Those are the uh, more problematic things. Go, we can just take down pilots. Let's keep moving. Just take down out the burst core. Basically, activates the weapon to empty its clip until there is very little. Uh, I do admire the humans of this of this bad these bad guys taking on basically these walking mechs. Warning, warning. Uh, warning, warning. Uh, I mean, it's, it's like anything, you take enough damage and you're not going to survive. Um, be shot at with a rocket launcher, you're not going to survive. <laughs> that guy, that guy clearly isn't paid enough to do this job. Oh, are we, are we in a rush? Are we trying to get to a ship? Oh, oh, here we go. And this is where this is going to get higher and heavier as we go along. Ow. Yeah, we are not in a good way. Uh, we are beginning to find that this is going to be difficult. And tempted to and upgrade our, our weaponry, but I'm not sure that's going to do us any good right now. go, we appear to have made that one easy to which is exactly what we want. We are bouncing quite low on health. You see that blue bar at the top? It means that these uh, side shooters will actually stand a chance at uh, these Those are weapons that can go down and mean that moving forward is good. Now I'm mostly focused on Getting this health up here. Go. Follow me. There's a lift up ahead. Follow me. There's a lift up ahead. I would, but I lost you. Oh, this year. So we're following that Titan, the one that we've been fighting with. Come on, now, pilot. Follow before me. we step in there, do we want to attempt to change our loadout? Um, so these are the various different loadouts that we've got. 
um, a 40 millimeter tracker cannon, a grenade launcher, a rocket launcher, a splitter rifle, um, drains energy, that's a lead wall shotgun, projectile shotgun with a widespread. Uh, we've got a sword block, which reduces the damage from incoming fire, and an arc wave, which slows and damages enemies. Um, we haven't yet found the north one, but that's the one that I feel would be fun. Here we go. Get ready, pilot. Going but up. we have no idea whether or not it will work. It does that mean being a part. bit quicker with our, with our blocking. Well, you're doing a good job, Roof Cooper. Opening. As far as I'm concerned, you've earned your pilot certification. Oh, thank you. Because I've survived this long, I have earned my now pilot let's finish this thing and get home. Well now, North Star. There she is. Uh, uh, we still have time to intercept the arc. Move, move. We should probably check what this loadout is before we use it. A mine that locks nearby enemy titans down, and a plasma railgun. Oh. And some sort of rocket shoulder. Uh, fire. being owned. So what I think we're going to do, I realise it is in the middle of the battle, but um, I think we're going to I quite like that coming through R up, so we didn't survive to use it again. <coughs> Use phase dash to get close quickly. All right, so we're gonna have to try that again and be very careful about our loadout. Very, very careful. Um, so we're gonna try again with the shotgun. That's our commander. And this is the guy that's stuck up on the last one. Uh, no, that's a blue. That's not a Well, that was more Okay, so that was quite successful. Um, uh, so this kind of uppercut, barky thing that we've got. Um, Okay, so that seems to do quite a bit of damage. I've never been. We are not going to go very well. We are targeted by multiple people. Battery essential. Let's see if we can just pop down here and give our shield a chance to recharge. There is a uh, bit of healing to get to it. Oh, we need to manage to heal. Um, <laughs> which didn't last very long at all, did it? Okay, so what I think we might need uh, is clearly more time with this. No, that's not the one we want. There we go. Yeah, it's, 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 
Ah, so this is our shield that we can hide behind. Um, what one do we want? That's the one. There we go. Alright, so we're back to the original loadout. First floor ready. Warning, battery is active. Okay, we seem to be doing um, a bit more this time. Because we can ah, we didn't survive that time. That didn't go well for us. So we're gonna have to try to find a better way of doing this. A much better way of doing this. So should we stay with this loadout and give it another go? Right, so we still got some health over there. And there we go, we can right there. Warning, detecting hull damage. So, so we can now take this. Battlefield rather than taking um, the health that he knows. Let's see if they can try to go, bit of healing. Shield up. Oh no, no, we don't need that. Oh, there we go, we managed to catch him here. You can see that. I'm not normally very good at it, but he's doing that. There we go, we probably. We keep catching them. We do more damage to them. Ah, Nick. Those weapons keep you stuck in the place. Ah, ha, ha, ha. See these, these little, these little things we can dash out of them. There we go. Send them back again. Oh, there's a, another bit of healing. Block. Get the healing. Be okay, we've got some healing. Now we can actually cause a bit more damage. You see why <coughs> I've decided that staying with this loadout is better. Despite the fact that I have actually got to, to do some quite nasty at the wrong time to And I need to put the weapon. Alright, so what have we got sort of left on the battlefield? Um, not like a lot left on the battlefield. This one over there could Bit of a mark. First floor ready. First floor activated. Make sure we push it right down. Here we go. We can do this. We need healing. Okay. These little traps are really irritating. <laughs> There we go. I was lucky. That was more luck than judgment. More luck than judgment, that one. Wow, that one has a good sword. I suppose what we kind of need to do is to actually watch the other people using the weapon mode and just see how that works. Find the 
better ways of using it. Because clearly what we've got is we've got this weaponry down there, but we haven't got any. Right, now, which that interesting point on Titanfall where more bad guys can actually get lost in our building. We're closing on the Draconis. It's also interesting in that it doesn't really kind of lead to... All right, so we were just standing next to that guy and he didn't do anything. Those that are backing the phone. These are these kind of really irritating bomb walker things um, uh, that show up quite often. Oh, wow. All damage. Okay, we are not doing well against this little guy. There we go. Down. Alright, what's the next? There. Down as well. Okay, keep pressing on, making sure we can protect these ones. Health is all very good in the back. There's more health there, but we don't need it. There's more health in there. So I'm gonna get. All militia forces, move in on the Draconis! Move in on this the Draconis. Yeah, get the first four ready. Oh. Oh, yeah, let's just take this thing out. Can everybody hear me out, okay, for those of you watching the stream? My voice coming out clear, because I'm aware that while this gets more and more intense, my voice keeps dropping down. Uh, not that uh, you need to respond, but also, uh, hello viewer, welcome to the stream. I hope you're uh, having fun uh, watching this. Uh, watching this. Okay, let's just stop that. Excessive damage. Warning. Warning. Let's just jog back here. Or did we drop down too far to be able to? Oh, we can go back. Ah, yes, the uh, Titans can't jump. So, running back for the healing while a clever idea didn't work. The rain. Oh, that didn't go our way, don't stand in the fire. Wow! Okay, that was, that was a surprise. That was definitely a surprise. That was definitely a surprise. Okay, so, let's do this again. Already, yes, please. We just take this guy down. Oh, I like trick smoke. Oh, steady on the go over there. Jumping stuff. 
<sighs> okay, so this is a very hard level. But, but then, as you can see, I'm not very good at this game. Uh, if you came here looking for somebody who can do the pretty dodgy titany stuff, this is not the place. The person who successfully activates their uh, protection uh, 30 seconds after it's needed, this is where we are. I'm hoping, really, that this kind of channel gives people uh, a little bit more faith in their own gaming ability. Show that you can play, you can stream, even if you're not actually... Uh, not actually one of those great gamers out there. Ow, ow. Uh, that wasn't uh, part of what I was saying, just a simple uh, bag. The, the controller really vibrates when you get hit that way. Um, I'm just going to run away uh, for a bit uh, and see if we can uh, find another way around this. Oh, I have successfully managed to gain a hand grip. Uh, uh, okay, this, this Titan really does not want to leave me alone. Um, <laughs> there we go. I didn't think I was going to last long when my health managed to start running down. So I think slower is, is kind of what we need to do next. Slower uh, walking forwards. So we've gained the I have the power hat-trick, uh, kind of, uh, uh, the uh, uh, achievements. Uh, what, what they actually mean, I don't know. Uh, hat-trick likely means I managed to take down the side with one go. First call, let's have some of that. Yes, and that one, and then and take that one down. And Go that way. Uh, I know that we need to get to that ship, but at the moment, we are currently held on a crack And you don't see the Ah, did not see that one. Okay, so. Moise dying a bit. Let's see if that will release the code. It did release the core, and we managed to get it uh, before we died. Those multiple weapons are our front uh, shield is not actually equipped to take them all on. But on the plus side it does mean that our shield is back. Uh, now that we actually have some power to power our shield. So we are now dying. Don't let them get away. Get to that ramp. Uh, retrieve the arc. The arc is headed your way. I'll let Viper take you from here. See you soon. <sighs> nope, nope, did not get there. I don't know ship. whether or not. After oh, are we going after them? All oh, right, okay. So it wasn't it was one of those slightly irritating um, failures of the of, of gaming in that you're sent on a mission to get somewhere, but doesn't matter what you do, you can't get there in time. It is quite frustrating, quite frustrating. So let's see, let's see what else uh, we're, we're off to next. We've, um, let's see what messages we're getting. We're not, nobody's talking to us yet, uh, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, we are on some sort of 
How to the building weapon. Yeah, that's a much better weapon. This is Commander Briggs. We have to recover the Ark. The IMC are taking it to the fold weapon on board the Draconis. All ships, flank speed. We have to hit them hard and fast. Briggs out. Copy that. Six four, okay, so we are going we go. to uh, get close to something and, and beat it up. And that's my Enemy So we just need to... Oh well, there's no point wasting ammo if somebody else. They go down. They go. All oh, right. So this is a. It's going to be a fun ship to go beyond the water. No, oh, we've got some fighty thing. A flying titan. Look at it. Flying around like a bug. So, we're going to have to squish it. I've got some toes. Um, and let's see. We're going to have some... Okay, we didn't squish it quick enough. I got you, kid. Raise yourself. Oh, that, that was painful. Thanks. Oh, we're going to be thrown. Let's do it. Cooper, get ready. So, this is this strange idea uh, just like that, that we can just be Not thrown exactly. onto things and there we won't die horribly. Two oh, thanks, BT. Uh, so. Did we make it? If we get where we were going. Six four, Coop. Cooper, listen up. We can't take you directly to the bridge. We'll never get past those guns. We'll drop you off at the stern and you'll have to walk away. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what happened there was while I was busy uh, looking around, I fell off the front of the ship. Uh, so it turns out uh, that this is not actually a piece of scenery. I will throw you to Black Oh, all right, BT. Come on, and let's do this again, then. Esmeralda, Esmeralda, when Just I said like toss me off, I didn't mean well, this. Exactly. There are significantly more variables Nobody to tosses at all. Come on, BT. Less talking, more with the throwing. So we're going to get thrown over onto this. Thing. And then we land. And do not fall off the ship. Well, I did last time. Cooper, listen up. We can't take you directly to the bridge. No, you can't we'll take us directly to the bridge. We'll drop you off at the stern, and you'll have to work your way forward. Uh, what is it? Contact left. Cooper, I'm gonna get as close as I can without crashing. Time your jump. Now, go. Wait, wait. I, I gotta pull away. Hold on. Okay. Right, so we have just landed on the enemy ship, uh, much to everybody's surprise, and we have somehow got to get all the way to it. We have to have some sort of strange rail gun. That's better, we've got a... A shooty does lots of damage in one go kind of, kind of weapon. Um, and being as it is, oops, we can also do this headshot thing, um, which is quite nice. So, um, one of the things that I do like about this game is that if you do take the time to aim and do actually hit them in the head, is that their helmet makes no difference. No difference to their survival. Going, but actually. Um, 
Oh, they've activated the uh, robot. Fun weapon. Die. Um. There we go. So we've managed to convert those robots to our size. Um. That seems to be more our style. Visual representation where it is on. Head on to here. The uh, while we leave those robots, clear up. What a shame, the world battery. is going sideways. I'm on a I ship that's brought by the black sky. Cooper, I need to get to the I didn't see that robot. I didn't see that robot. I didn't see that robot. So very sorry about that. So very sorry about that. Okay, so we've got a run to here. Robot too close, big close, um, which tends to be fucking max. I don't know how many robots are down there, but there's a lot. Along here, see what else we can do. Else to shoot. So, this one is out of ammo. So, oh, it's massive. Hmm. Bolt is some sort of energy. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Can we not do this? Could we go another way? Is there another way that we could go? 
Okay, so this is one of these wall jumping puzzles. You must jump on the wall, run along over there, and survive. Um, like that. Uh, and you saw how successful it was. Uh, <laughs> uh, not in any way, by the way. So this is going to be this is going to be a very long, uh, a very long attempt. That's a last one. Uh, so we are out of ammo with this one. So we will switch to the bolts. That's our, our last. Not quite sure what the point is of being able to say. into oblivion fall into oblivion that's that's what happened there wall running boots thank you thank you now we go to the here. what do you need me to do close the door and keep her steady he's not thinking yes no no wait a sec follow me there we go go on then off you go Never born. You see that? Just move your ass, Davis. Nope. Nope. That's not a thing. Not a thing I can do. So this wall running thing. It's kind of a nifty little mechanic, but I can't quite get it. So they're jumping off there. Nope. So even if I jump off when they do, I'm still not making it. 
again there's a thing that I'm missing I'm sure I went through it with the tutorials but this is just one of those that I just simply Nope. I feel like there should be some form of uh, some form of thing that I'm missing. We jump over here. Yeah. Nope. 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 I mean, I hope you guys don't watching me fall into uh, the floor repeatedly and again and again and again and again and again because that's what's going to happen here. Well, it's never boring. Is as I go up, he is jumping. We go. So that was a double jump. Easy double jump. Jump away from the wall and then just drop into. How are we? Cloak is useful for avoiding enemies. Avoiding enemies is not my problem. Jumping off the wall is my problem. Well, it's never boring. Just move your ass, Davis. All right, so there. All right. There we go. We got the trouble. That's how they did it. But even with that small addition. We didn't seem to get any extra height. I love this job. There we go. Well, it's never boring. Just go move your back ass, up, Davis. jump, run. Jump. There we go. The higher this time. We got the drop on Almost. That's that's probably the best that we've done so far so we can try that one more time see if we can get much closer but i'm not sure that we can but we are going in the right direction aren't we ah oh we could just no let's 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 just hop along on the top of the ship for a bit and then and then jump off a big hope that no. <laughs> well, it turns out the ring along the top of the ship didn't get us anywhere. There's got to be something here that we are missing with these kinds of things. Boink, boink. Did you see how far they were jumping? got to be something that I'm missing because I can't get them to fort jump that far alright move, move your ass Davis come on and success success Well, I could have done that, I think. better because this bit I understand what's going on. I understand where I'm making this So so long as it starts me this side of the ship we'll be alright. We'll be alright. But otherwise uh, otherwise we'll be in trouble. Well that was more successful than the last one. Go. 
mean, this is quite nice having some AI with me and show me how it's done. Ow. Oh, robots, they have activated the robots. That's not good. Let's just sit here for a moment. Oh, no, Joe, just execute him. There we go, and now that we're all back together, now it's not making I mean, this ship listing is um, quite annoying. Combat rolling all over the place. Room's clear. That's the bridge up there. Follow me. Follow you. Come on, Coop. Keep up. Objective take bridge. Up here. Up here. Up here. And this is the bridge. Oh, that's a ship. There's a. Fire is bulletproof. We're gonna breach the glass. Take your marks. We got by the stairs. Tango on the mezzanine. Shape charges are ready. Hey, Coop, watch out the 6 4 does it. Okay. Fire Cooper, are you ready? We've got my target. Breach, breach, breach! Clear? Clear. That's how it's done. Clear, clear, clear. On me. Cooper, get to the captain's console and disable the guns. Apparently I'm taking the captain's console which is at the start. Not bad for a five, is it? There they are. Kill the guns! Kill the, kill the guns! The way we do this is we stick a knife in. Copy that, 6-4. Cooper, Go. you still have control of the bridge. Use your data knife to steer yourself right behind the Draconis. No. Parker, get BT back to Cooper. You got it. On my way. On, oh, I see. Man. So what we're going to do all is all we're now going to go stomp that thing. Oh wait, I'm in control. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Too low, Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Cooper, Took me a while to realise I was actually in charge. Too low. We are pulling up. That's not the correct heading, Coop. Steer left. That's it. You did it. You're tight, Cooper. Here we go. Okay, how do we get out on there? DC, why did he... Ready to transfer control to pilot. Come on then. I don't know why the big robot didn't... Act oh, come on. I didn't know why the big robot didn't actually decide to use another window. Uh. Oh. Guys belong to me. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. Oh. On Sneaky. On to get with friends. I don't actually know what weapon is the beta with. Warning. Are we Uh, yeah. Yeah, that didn't that didn't go our way, did it? That didn't go our way at all. No, that was bad. That was bad. That did not go our way at all. Back. just saw a replacement battery, they were either side of me. Either side of me. 
Never mind, eh? Ow, oh, that didn't go well. Wow. Wow. Laser spot is effective versus Titan weak spots. This is not going to go our way, is it? This is not going to go our way. Okay. You know that bit where I think we should probably learn how to use the controls? Alright, so that is a one in a shot laser. Oh man! They say it is weak spots, but I don't even know what this weak spot is. Laser core. Okay, I don't know what that is, but that was really effective. That's the Viper. That's the one that keeps getting us. We've got to find a... Really finding it difficult to take this thing out. Good tone, good tone, box 10. Which is going to be just turning. You need to move a little faster than that, son. Speed is life. Yes, I know I need to move it. This thing is nailing. And not in a very fun way either. for the kill, I really wish you wouldn't. Long, 
not going our way, people. Not going our way at all. Ah, there we go. And we're out. I think, I think as weird as it sounds, I can see what the game is trying to do by giving us a slightly more powerful uh, weapon. But actually, I think we're going to go back to the first traffic cannon. This at least means I can just kind of dodge and move. There we go. So we're getting kind of two shots in. And then. And then we can kind of nail it even though we can't actually do you see what I mean so hopefully now oh, the salvo core online well that's there we go no not We can just pick these up now. Um, so I'm just going to back up a bit because I think I didn't pick the ones up I'm over here. There we go. There's another one. So this at least ensures that what we're getting is at least a decent amount of damage on him. Though it does mean we have no shield. So we do need to move. Ah. Yeah, we are not fast enough for this. I don't know if there is a replacement battery. No, there isn't. We need to be doing, we need to be doing a lot more damage, like an absolutely lot more damage to being able to get. Oh, but it has restarted us with just a focus on five. Well, that's quite nice. Go as it dodges out the way. We can just pick that up. Where are you? You need to move a little faster than that, sir. Speed is light. Viper one lost control. I'm losing control. Going down. Mayday, mayday, going down. Did we take it down? This is BT7274. I think we took it down. down. We've taken it down. Board the draconis and secure the arc. We'll prep for transfer. Cooper, ready for fastball. Uh, ready for fastball. This is where basically BT's calling this fast uh, fastball, but basically what he wants me to do, he wants to throw at me. Adjusting for wind Here we go. Calculating. Uh, 
thought we had taken this one down. Clearly not. Up to us, BT, you're missing an arm. Down here. This is not going to go well, what are we doing? We... we are approaching the Ark's containment unit. Okay, so we're not worrying about these guys. Letting them escape. The okay. containment unit is too large to carry. We must improvise. All right, so that's too large to carry. <laughs> You're improvising by smashing it. I cannot reach the arc. Cooper, I need your help. Okay, how do we get up there? Oh. This is not going to go well for us. Quickly. We need to get off the ship. We are running out of I'm time. I'm not sure I can move. Okay, so we are moving. Very, very slowly. There we go. Come out. This way, Cooper. And we've stuck it in BT. As BT explodes. Oh well. Oh well, that was good, wasn't it? Get the arc out of here! Negative. Yeah. We are trapped. What are you doing? Protocol yeah. 3. I will not lose another pilot. Okay. Brace for impact. Oh, great. So BT has feelings, doesn't want to lose another pilot, and has decided that the way to do that is that we all crash and die. Ah, oh, BT. BT. I mean, if I could like a robot, and let's be fair, I do like a robot, and BT, BT is very cute. I mean, not to look at, and not in any way to look at, but uh, definitely to, uh, in the way that they are doing everything they possibly can to save me. It's interesting that the way this game has gone about giving you upgrades is giving you better weapons for BT. I would have been interested... Uh, in a game which actually allowed you to uh, change the uh, the what the Once you have the personality the arc, and the type of titan you are holding to uh, wielding. Voice command, not recognized. Let me just rip it out of him. Can't risk it. The arc's unstable. Ah, there we go. Listen, hero. You have what's mine, and I want it back. Go on. Tell your titan to open up. Um. <laughs> now what? His feelings? Let's just be sarcastic, shall we? The Still guy has a trying to be a hero, eh? Still trying to be a hero. I'm a riding on this contract, my friend. So it's tell stuck into titan. his shoulder. That's if he nice. doesn't open up. Will shoot you in the head. You're gonna shoot me in the head anyway. Pilot Dumbass. Ocular systems marginal. Cannot visually acquire a pilot. Ah. Stand him up. Very clever, BT. Right here, right here. Yeah. You see him okay. now. Functions compromised by severe crash damage. I don't care how broken you are. There we go. We're trying to get BT to some open up. Things, some things still work in there. Now open up. There we go. BT's completely shattered. 
You still remember numbers, don't you? I'm going to count to three. One. Okay, receiving. Two. Okay. Now, that wasn't so hard, was it? That's the problem with teams. If you okay. don't win together, you die together. Okay. What the? Okay, BT. Sure. Shoot them at close range with your rocket launcher. Oh. Oh, Okay. Do you remember that bit where I was just saying earlier about how, you know, changing uh, Titans should be a thing in the game so that you can actually choose to keep your older Titan but it, it's more loyal? Um, look what they've done to BT. And my objective is Cooper, survive. Over here. Cooper. I can no oh, longer yeah. uphold the mission. But you oh. still can. Take the circuit. It is your best chance for survival. Okay. Extra inspect the circuit. Okay, so I get a weapon. And what's this? A knife? Okay. Uh huh. And basically the brain of the robot. Um, survive, resist, escape. External temperature high. Uh, okay, good. So, can we just open the door? Yeah, we can just open the door. Ah. Hacking is not using a knife. There we go, jump kit initiating, jump kit online. I'm picking up a data core, but it's a weak signal. Okay. Are you sure you have the coordinates? Boost the signal. I need to get through to them. Commander Brink, I have a lock on Cooper's position. There we go, so we can now bring this nice. What's your status? That was a bad time to uh, shoot, but we're getting this really nice a uh, kind of red arrow showing us where we need to shoot. Is dead. BT, Cooper, Cooper, okay. is that you? I'm picking up BT's signal. Okay, so they're picking up our signal. We can't respond for some reason. Um, go through that door. Yes, yeah, what we do is we go over it. Oh, okay. So this seer kit absolutely upgrades my abilities and. A ridiculous way. Oh. There we go, that was easier. As long as I keep my weapon loaded, I can just hit pretty much anything. Which is kind of excessive. So let's go. So this is the this is one of those things that keeps me playing this game. This is Commander Sarah Briggs. Is that it's it gives you these kind of real hero moments. Sure, okay, at the moment I'm being a hero because I am massively augmented by this seer kit. But, um... I'm going to guess I should have come down that line. But it, it really does 
it is really fun because these guys have just emptied a full clip into BT and I am not in any way inclined to be nice to them. Sure, BT will survive because I've got his brain in the end, but it's still just one of those... Oops, Do you see that? Two shots, I'm not even looking in the right direction. Why can't the game just, just give me this all the time? Why can't this just be a stand upgrade because the game wouldn't be fun? I know, but... Uh, you know, it, it's it's still mildly entertaining. It's, just keep moving. Just keep moving. I mean, yes, the arc is currently with the fold weapon. Um. Oh. Oh dear, oh dear. Um. So, it's one of these sides, isn't it? It's going to be one of these sides, and then it's going to be... Fine. Well, I mean, that was much easier with the seal weapon. Um, and I, I'm much surprised that I managed to survive that jumping puzzle. Which is also not normally a thing that we survive. But the only thing I need to remember to do is to upgrade, is to constantly give myself ammo. Preparing for Titanfall, eh? So any minute now we're about to be joined by some big uh, checkpoints. Okay, Titanfall about now would be good, guys. Wow. All right. Um, I'm not quite sure how we get over there. But let's start by getting a bit closer so we can actually take them back. Okay. This seer kit is amazing. Alright, let's just not bother with those because they are kind of doing a number on me. We'll just run around the back and murder them from there. Is it just me with my arrow not moving? Titanfall. Initialize the Titan. Oh, we have just got an upgraded Titan. And uh, welcome, Hello, uh, Love Beer two three three seven, to the channel. Uh, thank you for the follow and welcome for talking. Uh, new chassis, same, same Titan. Titan. Old paint, same data core. BT Old paint, same data core. Good to go. Oh, okay. It is time to complete our mission. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. All right, let's uh, dive onto this Titan and see where we're going. Bomb, 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 bomb. Cooper, I'm throwing everything I've got at the IMC, but it's not going to be enough to stop the fold weapon. I need we got to go stop this fold weapon. Commander Briggs to all battle stations. I want close fire support on Cooper and BT. Do whatever it takes to cover them. So right, what, what weapon do we have? Cooper, uh, the hell. weapon we have is a railgun. What is our shoulder? Uh, where they shield? Okay, so what we have is a railgun with a shield. Dum -dum -dum -dum. Uh, which seems to run out quite quickly. Okay, so we've got a shield on one side. Do -do -do. Uh, let's just take these guys out. Alright, there is a bit of a lag with the machine gun. So... Mini gun. We have a sensor. Ah, we do. So we can just take this gun. 
That's so smart call. There is a lot of these titans. A lot of them. I'm not sure that we actually have the the ability to take them all out. I can just dash and collect that, we might survive. Oh, well that seems to be quite successful. Where's the other one? There it is. Yep. These little things are annoying. There we go, smart core. What is a smart core? Okay. That was a big mistake, was it? I mean, for who? You? Me? What? Okay, so this weapon is not my friend, but also it doesn't seem like it's a good idea uh, to to actually adjust it yet. Keep moving, don't let up. Thanks for the advice, and also for your help in this particular matter. Okay, wow. Uh, that seems to pro co cause some sort of chain reaction. The stock engines went dark. Give me a sit rep now. Oh, get Got me a sit rep. The stock took a broadside. It's going down. Somebody's going down. Not much I can do about it from where I am. What we've got to do is stop this weapon. Come I've got a free. feeling it's going to mean me getting in here. Late to the party. You're just in time, Gates. How much juice do you have left in the Malta? These are people. Much easier killing people with this thing. But da 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 da. The downside is the length of time it takes to warm up this. Target locked. Firing. Right, All right. So down here, I guess. We will take right. that core. Oh, no, we won't. What we're going to do is blow this guy away. There we go. I still haven't worked out what the smart core does. Warning, warning. There we go. A lot of help. That will take all of that. We'll take all of that. We can do. Uh, don't get too close. Yes. Okay. Warning. Warning. Warnings all over the place. Okay. So, uh, back in the game, it's one of these. It's one of these things when the game gets quite intense. You do actually forget that you do actually need to be saying things when you're speaking, rather than just gently talking to yourself about how much you want to get. But one of the interesting things about Titanfall, uh, now that we do actually have our Stonking brand new Titan with some upgraded graphics around the screen, uh, we are getting a, it is slightly more responsive. I realize that that's quite difficult to, um, to show you guys, uh, but the, the way in which BT moves is, uh, is quite responsive. So we're getting quite a bit of uh, quite a bit more uh, movement uh, as it moves around. It's much more responsive. It's easier to dodge, uh, though most of these things uh, don't really uh, tend to track. So dodging is not really a thing that is uh, really available to us. Uh, and these things just keep coming. Uh, I do have a shield, so let's make sure we activate that. Um, and these things are uh, quite big and mean. Okay, yes, we've got to stop the IMC. Uh, press B to crouch. Ooh. Now this would be normally a place where I would be expecting a, a disembark. Uh, but it seems that actually instead what we're doing is is crouching. Um, I quite like 
the red mist as an addition to the game. Can you see? I don't know if you can get that to happen again. See the red mist that's kind of coming off when you, uh, there you are. Uh, when you destroy bodies. But it is kind of excessive. Um, really, I mean, I guess a truthful representation of what happens when you are hit by a minigun that's twice your size, but still. You know, uh, it's uh, come up into this facility. I think a lot of the uh, thing, a lot of the other benefits, though. So there's the weapon we've seen before. One of the other things about Titanfall is that a lot of this scenery is incredibly pretty. Very pretty. Gravitational lens correction. Bold calculation in global. Okay, so that doesn't sound good, being as these fold weapons um, can, according to the law of the game, uh, basically end planets. So, what are we looking for? What can we do to stop? This seems to be a case of keeping to move. Ah, here we go. Now go. My forces will take over from here. Uh, Time they do something. There we go. So that guy's gonna go. Sloan, this is the one that murdered us the last time round. So this is the battle. The battle where we are going to attempt to make sure this thing. Oh, of course, because she couldn't fight me on her own, could she? No, 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 that would be, uh, that would be too easy. That would be too easy, you know, she's got a... Okay. There you go, smart core, and we'll have a shield. There we go. Okay, where did she go? Where did she go? Where did we we blew it? Uh huh. Ah, that thing is fast. Come on. My close friend. Oh, there's some sort of other. Our reactor is unstable. Okay, so don't stand in the way of that thing. Oh, it portals. Oh, right. I'm going to guess that we have to kill this thing quicker than we're currently doing. Because. It's passing stage four. There it is. Go with this. And yep, okay, yeah, we are being attacked by lots of things. Ow! Oh, I thought you were dead. Um, wow! Okay. So that red lasery thing is not a thing we should stand in the way of. Not a thing we should stand in the way of. It doesn't go our way. Does not go our way. Oh, and here we go again. Right, so. Smart core ready. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, so...
that? Our reactor is unstable. There we go, our reactor fire. is unstable. So with the shield up, we are much slower. But... You better hope it's sure you take it as lucky as that one. Not always online, let's just use that too. Not a useful weapon. Old weapon passing stage three. Calculating Sorry, space for projection. But they also need to reload, so that's a good yeah, thing to know. And every time that they portal away, they leave behind a core. Oh, heels, go away, woman. Go away. Go away. Reaching lethal threshold. Personnel must clear the chamber immediately. Disruption of electromechanical units, including Titans, will be severe. Stay good night, you know, bastard. So we haven't killed her quick enough. I'll give you a hero death. I will not be destroyed by some pitiful excuse for a bloody hell. Just die already. Get the Ark out of there before it launches. Hurry! Okay, so we're going to have to ignore what's going on. Hope that we don't die. Uh... Oh, we are stuck inside. Here we go, we are attempting to reboot. Oh, great, there's an incoming hostile Titan. Oh, it's the, it's the guy that we, um, it's your lucky day, hero. that we robbed that thing off us. I don't work for free. Ah. But you don't get to kill me either. Yeah, you earned this, eh? Liz, that Vanguard class Titan is still in there. Not my problem, Marta. Should have put it in my contract. <laughs> other people with money to see. I like that guy. I mean, admittedly, at some point I'm gonna to have to kill him. Okay. So, what's on my? Cooper, I require your assistance. My auto navigation systems are, are, are offline. Can get me into that injector assembly. We must do this together. Together. Okay. So, what are we doing? Okay, so we're coming up. Our ground teams can't make it there in time. You've got to find a way to destroy the full weapon from the inside. There's no other way. Commander okay. Briggs, I believe I have a solution. In its exposed state, my reactor core may be able to destabilize the arc at the center of the full weapon. What are you saying? We can blow it up. I'm sending you coordinates for a dropship rendezvous. Sure. Coordinates received. We'll be there, but I don't see how you can. Tr trust me, I have done the math. I sure as hell hope so. We're on oh, great. So we're we're we're, we're we're relying on your hope. The us blowing BT up in the center of the weapon is gonna work. Okay. We got a way 
out of this one, VT. Okay. Protocol 3. Protect the pilot. VT, what are you doing? Trust me. Are we going to be thrown again? Okay. But we literally just got you back. Okay. I mean, we're going to die here. What we're going to do is what we're going to do is we're going to die a lot over and over and over again. Okay, so one of the things that we've learned here is that I'm not very good under pressure. Uh, yeah, that might here. be in midair. I mean, it might be in midair. We haven't done a jumping puzzle for a full 20 minutes. Of course, the evac site's going to be in midair. Oh. Uh, you're tracking me, that's grand. I have absolutely no idea where I am. Uh, so, we are just going towards this. Ah, not quite. Hmm. Was there a checkpoint anywhere in that? Otherwise, this is going to get tedious. Are we ready for this? Here we go. Jumping puzzle. Jumping puzzle when we can't see a thing. Jumping puzzle. And we wait. And we're going to come down here. And we run along here. And I don't actually know where we were meant to be going. <laughs> well, that was a surprise. You'd have thought with all this technology that a little portable um, kind of rocket launcher, I, I don't mean rocket launcher, Jetpack. A little portable jetpack would be most helpful. That's it. You're almost there. Move, move. Am I? I'm almost where, love. Cooper, jump for it. Jump for it. Got a visual. Point. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be full up. I like the fact that your hair is still Cooper, in a bandana. Oh, is that us getting out? Yes, that's us getting out. Warped away. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. We just detonated a planet. We just detonated a planet. BT, that was not a good idea. A lot of people owe their lives to you. A lot of people lost them. Barker, set a... We blew up a planet. Take us home. You got it. Okay, we can we just back to the bit where we just blew up a planet, and you're all just being very calm about it. That planet is in tiny, tiny little pieces. The destruction. We the blew the smeg out of that planet. The militia calls this planet their headquarters. Millions of others call it home. Commander Briggs says I'll be inducted into the Marauder Corps and assign a new Titan. After the tech swipe left of my neural link with BT. I don't know what that'll feel like to get assigned a new Titan. I kind of like the old one. Oh, wow. When are you assigned a new Titan? Signing off. Wow. Now, isn't that a thing? Because it appears uh, folks listening at home I really hope you are listening at home and I really hope that the microphone didn't cut out halfway through because we have just completed Titanfall. Thank you for watching this journey with me. Uh, as much of it as that you have managed to see because we did lose some of it 
uh, in the translation. And uh, thank you very much for, for joining me on this long journey. It is an interesting turn of affairs that at the end of Titanfall 2 we lose BT. We very briefly get a new chassis for him and then we nuke him and we destroy a planet. And in that planet's destruction we save our home planet. And there's something quite strange about the fact that we're sat here listening to what is actually quite cheerful, heroic music. And yet, we blew up the planet. There will be celebrations because the war, at least for now, is over. That there is a pause. And all of these people celebrating because we have done the impossible. But I think when history looks back, at this time in the Titanfall universe, the death of that planet should weigh heavy on the minds of these, these people. But what I think will be more telling is that I doubt it. Because while that was quite a hard, emotional and impossible kind of game, we went from being rookie to Titan pilot to chasing down this uh, this arc and wow uh, as we stop and pause and Matt Mercer was Jack Cooper Matt Mercer of course from Critical Role uh, one of the uh, prime uh, inspirations of many of us taking our role-playing geekery uh, to the online forum so thank you very much Matt Mercer for being the voice of this very enjoyable game. So we're not going to sit and watch the credits. Now, why do we sit and watch the credits? Uh, I do it with movies, and I think it's only right that I do it with games, at least for the primary names. Because a lot of these people put time and effort into making a game that we have enjoyed together. And it is so very easy for us to take their work for granted. Sure, I hear you all tell me they got paid to do it. They did indeed get paid to do it. But isn't it nice to know who it was that got paid to do it? And at least here in these, uh, in these cut scenes, we get to see properly the artwork of the Titans that we destroyed. The, uh, because a lot of these titans we destroyed from a distance uh, because getting close to them meant that we died and you can see the detail that's gone into these character models uh, the, the way in which many of them have been drawn and put together Sloan uh, Amy Pemberton and Sloan uh, and look at those titans. Those titans are quite pretty. General Marder, who we saw only uh, as as briefly as digital um, as digital projections. And here we go. Some of the the strange robots that we saw, or the strange masks that we saw. You'll notice that for a lot of them, they've taken inspiration from real-world tactical vests. Um, these kind of high pockets, so they're easy to access rather than on the waist, which is where you would normally, where, where we as civilians would expect to have them, but having them high up on the chest makes them easier to access and easier to see what's going on in them. Uh, nice to see that hip flasks are still a thing, though. The size of that bottle, that's not a hip flask. That is not a hit flask. We've got these strange backpacks, which never really was um, explained what they're for, but uh, I'm going to guess that these cutscenes is to give us a new sneak peek of what the new BT is going to look like. Obviously, not BT, BT's dead. Um, and there's another thing. Uh, other than our pilot who felt the death of BT. Uh, 
It is a very interesting way to kill off a main character. And if you've done your job right, then people care about the robots. So you kill off the main robot, and people actually care that we've lost a robot. But at the same time, avoid kind of excessive criticism because it was only an AI. And I think there's something uh, quite terrible about the way in which we believe that life that we have created like that can just be snuffed out. But humans have always privileged themselves um, as, being, uh, as being better than the lives around them. Isn't some of this scenery just beautiful? Titanfall 2 was indeed a very pretty game. As those of you that have listened along with us uh, have heard me say uh, many a time. Many a time. But I'm quite interesting as to why they have chosen to animate these scenes. Um, because yes, it is our return home. Um, but it's that, I suppose, it's that idea that if you're still filming at this point, yeah, we're still watching credits, but also we're half expecting something to happen. Something dreadful and terrible, I guess. But will there be? Will this actually just be the point at which uh, we fade to black, game over? We get our, our nice unlocks for having played the game and played the game well? Are there stats at the end for how many times I died falling into a pit? Which was many, let's be fair. Will there be stats at the end for how many times I fired several bullets and spent the game without an actual weapon because we had no ammunition? I wonder if there will be stats based on how long we've played and how long in many sessions that we've played. Now what is interesting for those of you who've made it this far and are still listening and haven't turned off because I'm just rabbiting over the credits is that Titanfall 2 actually felt like a very short game. And that's me saying it, somebody who's not very good at these games. I would guess, um, being as I got this game in June, that there can't have been more than six or seven play, uh, hours playtime uh, in it. Um, I started streaming Titanfall uh, not very far into the game. Uh, and so most of it, we I think we have minus maybe maybe a, an hour and a half somewhere uh, where where I just didn't bother saving it because there was no sound, uh, and I had no interest in going back and overdubbing myself onto uh, uh, onto the the defunct stream. But um, oh, interesting! Actually, Software Foundation gets a. Oh, well, that's interesting. I haven't, I didn't notice that Apache Software Foundation got a, got a link. Apache, by the way, for those of you that don't know, is what runs most people's web servers. Ah, oh, here's the, here's the after credits bit. It means that part of BT still survived. We hope, we hope. So, uh, thank you very much for, for watching us and uh, staying all the way to the end of the stream. Uh, thank you for all those of you that have uh, watched this uh, through to the end on YouTube. This, of course, is not the end of my streaming. There will be other things, GTA, for example. Um, uh, and of course, if you are watching this on YouTube, please check out some of our other channels, uh, our other streams on uh, No Man's Sky and other things. And if you are watching this on Mixer, please click that follow button, uh, give us a like. Everything helps get this little streamer uh, all the way up. And of course, remember, you can watch us on our sister channel over on Twitch. Uh, the username in both places is Black Xanthus. You can find our YouTube channel on bit.ly forward slash Zen Plays Games. And if you have stayed with us, this far then thank you very much for watching remember to like and subscribe and join us 
in these things. I've been Zen, you've been awesome, and thank you for joining us on Zen Plays Games. Good night, and go well. Bye-bye.